हेलो एवरी वन दिस इज टी सेट ए बी सी डी एंड वेलकम टू अनदर कटान वीडियो हियर ऑन माई चैनल सो टूडे आई एम प्लेइंग अ कैजुअल गेम ऑन दिस मैप फॉर द वेरी फर्स्ट टाइम सो दिस इज द अर्थ मैप एंड आई कैन सी बोथ द अमेरिकाज द आफ्रिका ऑस्ट्रेलिया एंड यूरेशिया यूर सीम्स टू बी अ फन मैच एंड आई एम ऑन द फर्स्ट पोजिशन सो लेट मी pick something here i am noticing that there is a decent amount of brick available on this board so yeah, actually 895 seems to be quite strong so i think i can just go for 895 here and uh, i can point to the right because if i get to the brick port my brick production increases with the port i think that is quite nice here Uh, while everyone else places, let's take a look at this board. Uh, sorry, at the rules, fifteen VPs to win. Discard limit is nine, and friendly robber is inactive. So that is something that we'll have to keep in mind. Discard limit being nine does give some leeway to hold on to cards. Um, with my, on the basis of this, I think for me. my ideal second placement would be 654 i don't think so it will be open yeah as i said it, it's been picked up i would be very happy to get even something like 6 the other 654 here especially with the access to the brick port it might be quite useful and if not that Yeah, I think then maybe something like eight ten two is not bad, but production is a little low. Even something like nine four can work on this board, to be honest, with the access to the three to one port. Wow, well, orange starts on the brick board. A little surprising. Also, I wouldn't mind going for something like. Eight five twelve. To be honest, yeah. So orange is completely dependent on bricks early on in the game. I mean, his brick brick production is completely off the charts. So it makes sense for him to go for the brick port. And because this is a casual game, I think even now uh, orange wants to have some fun. So, okay. Here I can also go for something like eight, nine, ten, but I would rather go for some more ore. Actually, I like um, eight, three, five here. I do start with a road in hand, and. Um, Yeah, I will not have a lot of sheep, but I think it is still quite a playable board, especially with the access to a uh, decent ore and um, yeah, with the access to decent ore and wheat, I think I should be able to make a lot of progress on this board. Or maybe I can go for something like nine, ten, three, with the option of going building at eight, three. Yeah, I'm running out of time here, so I think I'll just go for this. And yeah, immediately I roll a seven. So I'm just taking a look at who has sheep, and seems like green is the only one who has any sheep here. I get brick. Um, I mean, for now I think I can just go towards the brick port, but uh, I would have preferred if it was a sheep. It would have made uh, it a lot easier for me to get a settlement. Yeah, maybe I could have done a no block for sheep kind of a deal there. Yeah, let's see if I offer or is somebody interested in in this? Maybe green is interested in brick because nine hasn't rolled. Okay, green doesn't accept it. 
So I can also build towards it actually, to be honest. And if I get a settlement on, yeah, I think I will go for that option here. I can get a settlement on eight, nine, 10, and that would be quite strong for me. So here a single eight gives me a city uh, that would be quite nice. Wow, already making strong use of the two to one port. Yeah, sixes are excellent for orange. Yeah, maybe the six brick gets blocked. Yeah, it does get blocked here. And I think red can try and get a settlement on 953, increase their ore production. They already have decent ore and wheat. They're going towards the wood port. That makes sense with the option of building on 653 later on in the game. Yeah, and here I think orange will block me on the five break or target me on the five play break. Yeah. And yeah, does target me. Not much for me to do just yet. So Early on in the game, Orange does have a lead with the, yeah, here losing out on a break. So I think my only option or my easy option is to just get a city. And the reason why I'm building a city on 859 is so that I can get more uh, roads, make it a little easier for me to get settlements. surely like something else but it's trading with orange which means he doesn't have anything but break yeah he gets a trade with red yeah, and orange is making a lot of progress i mean tens and sixes have been rolling a lot as well so that is helping orange make easy progress Yeah, here, I am a little scared that r green beats me to 8, 9, 10. Yeah, I think orange will target the 8 wood again. Okay, solo blocks red, I don't mind that. I mean, red does have a, two dev cards. Wait, where did it, okay, he built a road towards 8 to 11, I see. Wow, 10s have been completely off the charts. So all I need is a single 8, okay. And I will have my settlement on the wheat tile. Oh, sorry, on the sheep tile. Yeah, I don't mind fives either. It gives me a couple of bricks and a wood. Surely can't let orange get an easy city. Yeah, so yeah, let's see if I get this trade. I think orange might accept it. Okay, orange is the first one to reject it, which is a little surprising to be, to say the least. How about a trade like this? Yeah, and here it seems like I might just run out of time. So I'll just build a road and end my turn. Yeah, 
Yeah, I think the six brick should be blocked here. But yeah, solo blocks me. Wow, I did not expect that at all. And immediately an eight is rolled. So I lose out on an over. I think I have lost out on the most cards in this game so far. And here, yeah. So it is very, very difficult to make a lot of progress because of being targeted throughout the game. And uh, also being blocked quite a bit. That said, what can I do here? I'm not sure. I mean, I still don't have any sheep and I don't think I'll be getting any trades for wood. Yeah, I don't think I have much option. Just do a forest to one, get a sheep and end my turn. Now green gets a city, so. Yeah, after being blocked throughout the game here, green is making strong progress. I offer the same trade, I think. Maybe because I'm getting a 1 is to 2, I should do it. Yeah, I think I'll go for it for. So now, if. Yeah, 8 haven't been rolling either. I surely seem to be falling behind in this game by quite a bit now. That's it. Because of that file, let's see if I get this, at least I'll be able to get two settlements in this turn. If I offer a one is to two, maybe somebody accepts it. Yeah, nobody's accepting it. That said, I mean, I can still get a settlement. Uh, I mean two settlements because of the three of the two is to one port. So now I think fives would be an excellent role for me. Also eights are much stronger because now eights, apart from wood and ore, I start getting sheep as well. Yeah, lose out on a couple of wood here. Yeah, I think I will also try and get a settlement on the brick tile over here. Maybe get a settlement on six nine six ten three. It's still a long shot because I have to build quite a few roads to get there. But I can still give it a try, to be honest. And now that Orange has started collecting dev cards, it is very, very scary. Here, I think my only option is to get a dev card and in my turn, I get a knight, which is good. At least helps me unblock myself. So green is also making quite a good progress here. He's already on eight points. I think the issue with my setup is I have, I'm too dependent on eights and fives. But yeah, I mean, green is already on nine points. So there should not be anyone else who is targeted but green.
I'm happy that the eight sheep is not blocked, but at this point it helps green a lot more than it helps me. Plays a knight. Yeah, and blocks green. I don't mind that at all. I would have preferred if this was a monopoly. Like playing a monopoly on either ore or brick would be very, very strong on this board. Especially because orange gets a lot of brick every time a seven is ro sorry every time a six is rolled, and these fours are also not helping me much. Finally, a nine. I think it's a nine after quite some time. Yeah, orange keeps on targeting green. I mean, green should be targeted. He's already on nine, but um, orange is the one who is making a lot more progress because orange will be able to get the longest road in the long run, I believe. I get another knight. Um, yeah. And eight is excellent. That said, I would want a couple more eights to roll so that I can get my city on the eight five three spot. Even road building on this board will be very strong. Getting knights, I think, is the weakest card on weakest dev card. Because the map is this big, road buildings and monopolies will work wonders, to be honest. Also, I mean, green already has three dev cards, so. I am surely falling a lot behind now. So, I think Orange can get a settlement. Yeah, it does get a settlement. Yeah, with the cards I have at this point, I think I'll just hold on to them. I need to get a settlement and a city. And, um, but immediately a five is rolled and I am over nine cards. So maybe it was a mistake. Hopefully no sevens are rolled because it would be very, very bad. And, um, yeah, eights and more fives would be excellent to be honest. Yeah, nine is rolled. I don't mind that, especially because the nine brick is blocked. So at the very least, I'll get a settlement this turn. I would want to get a city as well, but uh, yeah, that I don't think so is possible. Unless I get a trade here, I don't think I will. Okay, orange accepts it. Yeah, I think I'll be fine with it. So now I will get a settlement and a city. I am more than fine with this here. I'll end my turn. You know, eights are excellent for me, giving me three ores, two wood and a sheep. Seems amazing. Green 
green can here just take the largest army here to be honest now i would want a lot more nines to roll because nines give me wheat and ore let's see wow i'm surprised green did not play a knight i mean if green played a knight he would have maybe won the game if he has 3 vps has to target green i would say on the maybe eight sheep because green has the sheep port or the eight or wow solo blocks orange that does not make any sense yeah so in my case i think i have to play the knight we need to make sure that orange takes road or else green just wins here and with these cards in hand i think i can go for another dev card if nobody claims knight i can surely do that i don't mind it i get a vp so yeah as expected green does take the largest army and soon maybe green might be able to take the longest road as well hopefully that doesn't happen i need red to hold on to it sorry orange to hold on to it so yeah here nines help me I think I'll just play my knight. I know green needs to get um get a city and I think because of that I will block him on the old tile here. I get more I think just maybe I can try and get a sheep here. even offering a 2 is to 1 is better than me doing a 4 is to 1 to be honest but because i'm running out of time i'll just trade with the bank i do get a knight so if yeah seems like green doesn't have a knight but he can just get a settlement and win the game if he has 4 vps to be honest or maybe if he has a monopoly he can just play it on brick or wheat and that would be gg as well so red targeting orange yeah does play a monopoly expected it hurts orange the most and might give the longest road back to green here okay seems like green is going for a dev card or a city Okay, it does go for another dev card. Wow, basically it does a twelve is to three there. Four is rolled. So if I play my knight, I will be stealing a wheat most likely, or a wood. I mean here red is also in a very strong position. Yeah so will block green I think on the 8 sheep on the 9 wheat okay. Yeah. So I do get some uh, I think I'll just go for another dev card. I get a year of plenty doesn't help me at all. but for now i think i can just hold on to these cards green yeah plays a knight which is expected here 
and green targeting red is also completely understandable because red could also be on 11 or 12 points but for me i think fighting for army is becoming more and more difficult with every passing move if red has a knight red can just play it block the eight or i think that would be the best block it doesn't play a knight does he have four vps here i don't understand and why did he play the knight after rolling the die okay blocks the eight sheep i don't mind that i mean i i understand that is the right block and the eight does roll so i'm more than happy with it because it would have helped green a lot more than anyone else here i think i have to play my knight continue to target green and with all these cards in hand i mean i can get a road settlement i cannot play my year of plenty because i already played my knight so yeah i think i'll just go for a dev card try and get the largest army wow i did not realize there were no more dev cards left so yeah because of that i think my only option is to build a road settlement and then i'll just end my turn so there is a monopoly which uh orange has here but with this card i cannot do anything with it yeah he can easily play a monopoly on or it would hurt me quite a bit okay so he does not have two vps so i have one vp i believe orange has one vp and red has two or maybe three I'm not sure but the fact that green did not play a knight here actually which just wins the game okay um yeah gets a settlement it was a fun game but green was always in the lead and i was always struggling sixes and eights were quite even and also nines i mean i don't know i just felt my production was a little lacking this entire game yeah and uh, yeah apart from red i mean if you see my production was quite far behind red and uh, sorry orange and green this entire game but total amount of resources lost for orange was highest i mean he had to do a 2 is to 1 every time anything happened which made sense uh, because of his sport strategy i don't think so it was the best yeah i could have taken the largest army on this turn but um, yeah i did not get the chance to do that at all and i think orange just spent a little too much of his resources on securing the longest road he should have actually uh enticed green on building a few more roads but uh, yeah that is what it is anyway uh bye for now and see you again in the next video bye bye